Hi there, my name is Gabriel, SEO manager at Hike SEO, and today we're going to be going through how to use Hike platform for keyword mapping. Now, keyword mapping is a really important step to getting your search engine rankings, more organic visibility, more traffic to your website. And why is that? Because the rule that one unique topic per page uh, prevents duplicate content and ensures a fantastic user experience. So the idea is to map a unique keyword or more specifically a unique topic because there can be many keywords for a specific topic to one single page and each page on your website should have a mapped keyword or group of keywords. Now let me break this down a bit more uh, once we go through this, um, but I want to show you how to do this in Hike so you can do it quickly and easily. So the first step you would have already done is the keyword research. So under strategy, uh, you would have done this in the keyword research section and you would have a collection or list of keywords that you already collected. Now, this stage is where you take those keywords and you match them with existing pages on your website and potentially new pages on your website. So you can create new content around for further opportunities. So for example, on this page, uh, you'll see that um, if you go to strategy keyword sitemap, this is where you would map everything. And you can add a page right here. So you can either select a page uh, from your website because Hike automatically crawls your website for all of the pages that it can see uh, that are indexable. And then you can add it to the list in Hike. So you can go through and add in the ones that you want to work with at the moment. Um, at this stage, uh, I've added just a few. Um, so just not to overwhelm yourself. So I would add a few at a time, match it, add a few more, uh, match match them, a few more, et cetera, et cetera, and work your way through the list. So once you have your pages in here, it will display the page title and the URL. And here, this is where you would basically add the keywords. So you can also search, quick search them if you have a long list and you want to identify a specific page. About, uh, otherwise, you can just scroll down. Now, the cool feature with Hike is you can auto assign keywords. So basically when you click on this, it will automatically assign one of the chosen keywords that you've done here with the most appropriate page. Um, especially if it's already ranked within Google's top five pages. So this is a really easy way at, to save time. And the ones that it doesn't automatically assign, you can do it manually. So go ahead and try the auto assign feature right now. And if you click on that, it will automatically do that. So obviously at this stage, I don't have any keywords to auto assign. So you'll need to um, either go back here or add more pages uh, in here. Now you can also watch a quick help video if this video didn't explain everything you wanted to know. Um, so you can click here and this gives you a different perspective um, if you want to know how to use this. Uh, you can also export uh, as a PDF or CSV. So if you want to export all of these pages with the keyword maps, if you would prefer to use uh, Google Sheets or Microsoft Excel or any other spreadsheet software, you can do that here as well. So how do you add them manually? Now uh, you click on add keyword and then you would scroll down and choose the keywords, uh, the keyword from the list that you've done in your uh, strategy keyword research section. So at this stage, I don't have many here, but let's say we want to assign one. Uh, it will also tell you the keyword intent. So this is the type of keyword. If it's an informational keyword, meaning it's meant for like content, informational purposes, or transactional, if it's something uh, where people are looking to buy something or purchase uh, a service or a product. So that's transactional. They want to um, look, it's more commercial in that sense. And this is more informational. Okay, so you click on one of these, for example, 
and don't mind me I'm I'm not actually assigning a specific relevant keyword I'm just showing you how to do it so you click on add one keyword to page and there you go now I want to show you a few things that happens if you don't do this correctly so let's say you add a keyword um, okay so if you add a keyword here let's do that um, if you okay so what happens is if you by chance have a very similar or same keyword it will flag it in hike and that's a warning sign that you need to remove one of those duplicate assigned keywords because we can never have a page uh, that ideally uh, that basically focuses on one keyword if you do you'll have to use a canonical tag now if you don't know what that is right now don't worry but the the best rule of thumb is one top one unique topic per page so one primary keyword per page now here's the really important thing is when you map keywords you want to have a primary keyword so the main core topic and then you can have secondary keywords and these secondary keywords they are meant to support the main the main primary keyword so if my primary keyword is let's say website SEO and then similar uh, secondary keywords could be uh, SEO for website um, how to do website SEO and many variations and those are secondary keywords that are pretty much the same meaning as a primary keyword but it provides additional context different variations you can also add other keywords that provide um, context and these are these are called lexical semantic indexing keywords uh, don't worry it's it can be don't worry about that at the moment but I just want to make you aware that these are um, additional keywords that provide context so um, for example it could be something related to websites or something related to SEO so don't worry about that now that's a more advanced topic uh, but the main thing that you need to realize is you need to have a primary keyword and if you do have secondary keywords that are really closely related to that main primary phrase then do add those in but what you want to do is you want to have that page focused on that main topic so that's really important um, when you do the keyword mapping and you want to have all of these unique now the difference between the primary and the secondary is the primary ideally has the highest volume it's the highest value keyword so it has the best balance between uh, search volume um, lowest difficulty possible and a high relevance to the topic that this page is about now let's say you don't have a page uh, in here on your website currently but you have keywords that you want to create new pages around all you do is you click add page and then you can actually enter your own URL so let's say I want to create a page I guess here co and I want to call it like how to do keyword mapping and then check this box if you haven't built this page yet and add it so again uh, this is the new page you'll need you can basically move it around using these arrows and then what you want to do is you can edit the URL if it's not actually um, if you if you want to change it at all so you can do that and then add a keyword so obviously this page um, I don't have a keyword but you would have a keyword if you want to create a new page and you would add it so that's how you do the keyword mapping using the hike platform uh, if you have any questions at all uh, or any specifics do reach out to us uh, at support at hikeseo.co or you can message below if this is a social media platform just comment below and leave your question insight observation whatever it is you want to share and we'll get back to you as soon as we can Great. Have a fantastic day and all the best with your SEO.